Well, hi there, Internet. My name's Court. You've got courtside seats for my review of Reign of the Supermen. Let's do it. Reign of the Supermen is an animation action sci-fi from director Sam Liu, Warner Brothers Animation, and DC Films. The movie stars Rain Wilson, Rosario Dawson, Cameron Monaghan, Nathan Fillion, Rebecca Romaine, Jerry O'Connell, Jason O'Mara, Tony Todd, Patrick Fabian, and Cress Williams. Following Superman's sacrifice to defeat Doomsday, the world reels from the superhero's death. Several different versions of the hero pop up on Earth to take his place, including Superboy, Steel, Cyborg Superman, and Eradicator. So this movie is the sequel to last year's The Death of Superman, and you can see my review up there somewhere. And while I had a couple problems with that movie, overall I really enjoyed it, and I'm happy to say I really enjoyed this one as well. The voice cast is really solid, our main character this time around is Lois Lane, voiced by Rebecca Romaine, because rhyming is fun. And she's really good in the role. She's spunky, she's fiery, she's a little bit sexy if I'm being honest, but she also plays the heartbreak of having lost Clark really nicely. Now the Justice League are not in this movie all that much, but I still think that Rosario Dawson is a kick-ass Wonder Woman. And I've really come to like Jason O'Mara's take on Batman over the last few years. And the rumor is he might be the guy voicing Batman in the upcoming animated adaptation of Hush, which I'd be all for. Cameron Monaghan, who is Jerome or Jeremiah or whatever on Gotham, he's a new newcomer to this movie. He plays Superboy, and he does a really good job. He's really, really smarmy, but he also imbues the character with heart when he needs to, and I like that a lot. Now, much like the last movie, I did not like Rain Wilson as Lex Luthor. I like Rain Wilson, I just don't think he's a good fit for the character. Fortunately, in the last movie, I found him really, really annoying. I didn't find him annoying in this one. I still didn't like him, but he wasn't annoying me, and that's something. And there's not a whole lot of humor in this movie, but almost all the jokes that they put in there land for me, except for one joke about a butt dial, which I thought was kind of dumb. And there's a lot of good heartfelt stuff in here as well. I even got choked up in one moment, I'll admit it. The movie really knows when to embrace the goofy and when to take itself seriously. It straddles that line really nicely. Now, I did find the sound mix in this movie to be a little bit problematic. It's not a problem when it's just a conversational scene, but in some of the bigger action scenes, the sound effects and the music are a little bit high in the mix, and it makes hearing some of the dialogue a little bit difficult. Now, unlike the first one, where I really didn't like the design of Doomsday, the character Doomsday, I liked all of the character designs in this movie. On top of which, the animation was smooth, it was very colorful, I liked it a lot. And the pacing is really strong. This movie's just under 90 minutes, and it flows beautifully. I did find the climax to be a little bit abrupt, but it wasn't really a problem for me, just a observation. What can I say? I really enjoyed Reign of the Superman. It's a fun little animated movie, and you know what I gotta say? Bring on Hush. Now, I don't have a proprietary rating system as of yet, so I'm just trying to figure out what I'm gonna give Reign of the Superman, and I think I'm gonna give Reign of the Superman a... Don't try to follow me. I have a cab waiting. Out of 10. So now I want to know, have you seen Reign of the Superman? What did you think about it? What is your favorite DC animated movie of all time? Whatever your thoughts, hit the comments below. Let's discuss. If you enjoyed this review, please smash that like button and give it a share if you really enjoyed it. And hey, why not take a second, do me a favor, click subscribe and ring that bell to subscribe to my channel for more movie reviews, entertainment news, trailer reactions, all that good stuff. Thanks very much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one. Take care.